Now let's take a look at the pulse width modulator. It has an on-off switch right here and a like a volume control. It's a potentiometer with a switch, on-off switch. It has six. These might be MOSFETs or they might be uh, just transistors. And this is where you hook everything up. Filter capacitors. And this is a pulse width modulator controller circuitry down inside here. What a pulse width modulator does, it provides a variable width pulse. It's usually used in stepper motors, but with the pulses, it's like shocking, like you hit it. When you're inside here or with the electrons, or instead of just a steady flow, it's like pounding a Pound and pound and pound it every time it pounds. The shock makes it easier to break these molecules apart so that you have oxygen and hydrogen in the proper amounts and with less current. Pulse width modulators uh, are used for this purpose.